So here's a pretty good story on how I ended up buying these two thermal flask bottles. I needed a new bottle for the gym and this is the one I chose and the reason why is because of the top. My partner needed a new bottle for nighttime sleeping so we chose this top for them. Now the reason why I chose this spout is because it has a very good locking mechanism versus the spout on the green one because for that you have to use your fingers to pry open the bottle. Now I work out a lot, so I need a bottle that in case it lands on the floor at the gym for whatever reason, it doesn't leak. The black bottle, as you can see, does just that, not leak and it's completely locked. Now this one, as well, does not leak, so if my partner drops it at night, that's great, but there's no germs all over the tip of the bottle because it's not being used at a gym. So to make sure this thing doesn't leak, they put an actual rubber band on the inside to prevent from leakage. But if you open the cap, you can see that there is also a rubber band right inside there. So that's how it prevents this from leaking when you close the top and screw on the cap, just simply because of that actual rubber. Now on the rubber and the green one, there's a green one all the way around, plus in the middle, to prevent from this bottle from leaking too. Now this is the best part. It's the silicone that goes on the bottom of the bottle, especially if you're gonna be using this bottle at nighttime. Without the rubber, if you put it down, you're going to hear it. But with this rubber put on, it prevents you from hearing so much noise. Same thing for the green one, which is what it was bought for, bedtime. Put your silicone on, that way it doesn't make too much noise. Both these bottles are the same in size, absolutely phenomenal combo, and great to use anytime.